Why is it impossible to steal a Tesla? Buy a Tesla automobile and save yourself from car theft. Yes, according to the Highway Loss Data Institute (HLDI), Tesla's 2016 to 18 Model S and Model X were among the least stolen automobiles, with only the BMW 3 Series outperforming them. The new Tesla models are protected from any type of burglary. But how? Stay tuned to know more about it. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Hit like and for more such Tesla related news, subscribe to our channel. Also, don't forget to press the bell icon. Having said that, let's get started. According to the institution, this is because electric vehicles are often parked in garages where they are charged. But if that's the case, where are the other EVs in the top 20 list of HLDI? Two of the vehicles on the least stolen list are the Tesla Model S and Model X, according to HLDI. Their low theft rate might be attributed to the fact that as electric cars, they are typically stored in garages or at residences near a power source. HLDI demonstrated in a second analysis last year that electric vehicles from various manufacturers have lower theft claim rates than comparable vehicles. Regardless, Tesla has worked hard to achieve its pole position on our list of the least stolen items. Furthermore, the comparatively few stolen Teslas have an outstanding recovery rate. From 2011 until May 28, 112 of the 115 stolen Teslas were recovered, according to the National Insurance Crime Bureau. In 2016, the overall recovery percentage for all automobiles was only 58.4%. That's about as good as it gets, says Frank Scafidi, the National Insurance Crime Bureau's Director of Public Affairs. I wonder whether the criminal's brains were overloaded by sitting in a Tesla, let alone figuring out how to run one for any period. While most new automobiles have excellent anti-theft technology, the Silicon Valley car maker outperforms the market in terms of both the theft rate and the recovery rate. So what makes Tesla's vehicles so appealing to thieves? Much of this is due to three important Tesla security features, GPS tracking, sentry mode, and pin to drive. Since Tesla's early days, GPS tracking has been a security feature. Owners may get a real-time car location data using Tesla's phone app, if a Tesla is ever stolen, owners may use their phone to inform police where their vehicle is. It's happened several times before and accounts for a significant fraction of recovered stolen Teslas. One disadvantage of this function is that to conserve battery life, the automobile only updates in real time when driving. In principle, a competent burglar might remove the car's SIM card to avoid tracking entirely. Another strategy used to prevent burglars before they even attempt to steal the car is Tesla's sentry mode. When you enable this option, the car will remain in monitoring mode. Even when the automobile is turned off, the two side cameras, the front camera and the sensors will continue to function. In turn, the Tesla monitors its surroundings, ready to alert its owner and anybody who comes too close to the car in the unlikely case that theft is taking place. The monitor indicates a recording in progress and the car does just that. This is enough to make the bulk of thieves hesitate. And for those bold thieves who persist, the danger is merely being apprehended. So let's imagine a skilled burglar successfully executes a relay assault, disregards the ongoing recording and removes the car's SIM card to avoid detection. Because of the pin to drive function, the burglar will still have difficulty driving away. To drive the Tesla, you must input a pin code. The pin pad placement even changes with each startup to prevent fingerprint smudges from being read. Entering your Tesla account credentials is the sole method to reset the pin. The key to this Model S was found near the rear of the home, but pin to drive was turned off and passive entry was enabled. Anthony Kennedy's YouTube video. Using the owner's account credentials is the only method to drive away with a stolen Tesla in this situation. Fortunately, the majority of petty auto thieves lack the abilities required to break into your Tesla account using phishing, social engineering, brute force approaches, and so on. If Tesla owners are still concerned about these sorts of edge circumstances, there are various precautions they may take to protect themselves against auto-hacking. Having said that, as we have come to the end of this video, let us know your view on this. If you want to be updated on every single topic related to Tesla or Elon Musk, consider subscribing to the channel and pressing the bell icon. We'll see you in the next one. Until then, peace.